Jurassic World Chaos Theory Season 2 concept toys. All but four of the figures I will talk about are 100% speculative, not confirmed to be coming, but I still think are possible to happen based on what we are missing from figures. So let's start off with the minis. Here we have a 20 pack of minis, including Majungasaurus Major, Bumpy, even though it's not Bumpy, the Atrociraptor Squad, Fire of the Campers, and other fun Season 2 dinos. But moving on, one of my speculative things is a human pack with Ben, even though we've already had Ben, but one of the minis show Ben with a different shirt, so I think we could get that. A green tiger, because we're missing a camouflage tiger. Of course, Captives made it, but Mattel has not yet made it, only a camouflage panthera. And one of the eggs from the egg case. I don't know which dino it will be though. Next up is one with Brooklyn. We're obviously missing an adult Brooklyn figure, so I think it would be perfect to finally get her. And I think green, red, a camouflage version of red would be perfect to go with her considering red was missing from season one and brooklyn was missing throughout most of season one and then obviously it will come with another medium-sized egg and then sammy sammy is really neglected with an adult figure right we should have got one for season one i don't know why we did it but anyway now i think is the chance i think it could come she could come with panthera the atrociraptor we don't have a standing up panthera besides the camouflage one so this could be perfect and it could come with an egg of smoothie which is baby's bumpy now moving on to medium story packs i think there could be one for sammy which will come with another medium egg the third medium egg or technically the fourth because smoothie counts as one but i was kind of ignoring that and i think maybe we could finally get an angel spinoceratops figure with this set and speaking of in the next medium story pack i think rebel the spinoceratops could come in there they'll either be you know they could be babies but i think they might age them up and make them teenagers if they are to appear in chaos too just like the jurassic world live ones that would just add their teenagers and i think this pack will come with yaz and our fifth or fourth medium egg depends on if you include smoothies egg or not but now the big story pack so this one is like that Darius one that came with Cantorus and the Ben one that comes with Sukumimus so like we're going to talk about Ben with the AK Sukumimus and the Gallimimus which will have a name so that's this pack this is confirmed as a season two pack so that will be cool and I think we could get something similar with Brooklyn because obviously I've only named one Brooklyn figure but most of them are getting two besides Ben who could probably get three but Brooklyn will come with one of the small eggs because we have the Compi which was one of them the Velociraptor which was one of them so we're only missing one small egg so I think Brooklyn could come with that I think a Grey Sukumimus the one from episode 10 and a bigger version of Smoothie the Ankylosaurus now Danger Packs we know these ones are coming Rowie Sukus so that's 100% confirmed. I don't know if it's for season two. It shouldn't be. I do believe Majungasaurus is the only new creature I've heard of that's going to be in season two. So, and we'll get over to Majungasaurus later, but something that could be in season two is Demorphodon. We do know it was on the boat and it is getting a wave two figure. So, or wave three, technically. Sorry, we're on to wave three because this is epic evolution, but technically wave two for Chaos Theory, if you understand what I mean. So yes, Rari Sukas, Demorphodon, we 100% know those danger packs happening. I don't think any other danger packs would happen. Otherwise, they could have been confirmed. Then again, I could be wrong. Anyway, strike attacks. Monolophosaurus, that brand new one. I think maybe we could get another paint scheme. You know, maybe there's multiple of them in the show like there were in Camp Cretaceous. And this one, I assume, you know, could have like a beach pattern of sorts, right? Could be sandy with like a blue crest, whatnot. Just like the old Monolophosaurus, basically. But then Dilophosaurus. So yes, we did. We've got a ton of Dilophosaurus, but we've, I don't think we've really gone the Season 5 or Manticorp Island Dilophosaurus with the pink crest. So I think that would be cool to finally get a hold of that, you know? And even though it would mostly be the same color scheme, I think the pink crest would be super cool to get a hold of. And now... Pyroraptor. Obviously, this is not a recolor, but the previous ones are. That's why I think this way would be easier to do because most of it is just recolors. But Pyroraptor, we did get the extreme damage Pyroraptor, which is basically like a strike attack, except it's got the damage. So, you know, you don't have to change it up too much. And Pyroraptor could be in season two. So, you know, but then also red Atrociraptor. Now, I only mentioned a camo red in the human packs. I think maybe considering tiger got an extreme damage figure too which is kind of like the strike attacks maybe they could repaint it as red because i don't want a crouching red no one likes the crouching raptors we already have a normal red so maybe we could get a strike attack red i think that could be pretty cool but now let's move on to wild rolls first one up is black majungasaurus this was kind of the reason i made this list it's because we know the minis are getting a black majungasaurus and a blue majungasaurus which is major so it's like what about a bigger figure? So, 
you know, maybe we could see the black Majongasaurus as a wild roar, along with a green Pachyrhinosaurus, because sure, we had the brown Pachyrhinosaurus toy, but the main Pachyrhinosaurus throughout the first season of Chaos Theory was a green one, so why did we not get a figure of the green one, but instead a brown one, which I don't think made an appearance at all. We might have gotten like a purplish one, but I don't know if we really got a brown one. Anyway, moving on, red Ceratosaurus. Now, this new mold of Ceratosaurus, people really like the mold, the green Ceratosaurus. The problem is that people were like, this mold's so cool, but the colors are not my favorite. And, you know, if it had those red colors, it would look fantastic. And I do believe red Ceratosaurus could be here, thanks to captives. But anyway, the, our last wild draw, the Eyeless Baryonyx. This has been talked about. A poster revealed an Eyeless Baryonyx a while ago for Chaos Theory, and we know that's going to be in Season 2. Very exciting. So, how can we get a toy of this? I think wild draws, this could be the water one instead of our Hadrosaur, Parasaur, Lufus Lux. We could get an Eyeless Baryonyx instead. But now, Gigantic Trackers. This one would be a couple of repaints as well. Green Bajatosaurus. So, obviously, we had the brown Bajatosaurus in the first wave of gigantic trackers but in concept art we saw chaos theory was originally meant to have a green bajatosaurus so maybe we could get it for gigantic trackers that would be cool anyway our second gigantic trackers quetzal quietless so i assume they could easily repaint the dominion one and it hasn't gotten a hammond collection figure so you know it's still good chances people could buy it it could look more accurate obviously save the accuracy for the hammond collection one but you know add more brown to it and whatnot if it is in season two anyway but the big figures blondie beckel spinax this one would be easy just repaint the brunette beckel spinax we got so obviously that one's more green but this one would be more of a swampy yellowy brown color you know with the orange on its neck so i think that's quite possible to have him and i think it would be cool to get both the beckel spikes in metal form but now big et why do we not have a big et yet why did they choose to give rexy another figure right just paint it gray please like and i know it's not the best t-rex figure but we're seriously lacking in terms of a metal T-Rex, and we know they're making a grey young Rex, so just give us Big Edie, please. But now, Lego sets. I just want to quickly talk about Lego sets, because I think we could get a Brooklyn and Red Atrociraptor set, you know. Obviously, we got a few sets for Chaos Theory, but Brooklyn was missing. And in Dominion, we got Tiger, and we got Ghost, but we're still missing Red, and that kind of leads me on to the last set I want to talk about, which is a set with maybe a camouflage green Panthera, so we can have the full Atrociraptor squad, even though they won't all be the same colors, but I assume LEGO wants to variate their creatures, so they'll give them different colors. I think it would also come with Lewis Dodgson and Ramsey if they make it into Chaos Theory. Anyway, make sure to watch the previous video up here, and I'll see you later.